about an hour, not too long. So what I like doing once it's set is just taking it out and cutting it into small little cubes and then wrap them in some baking paper, kind of twist it up like a little present, you know, just like the festive season. You never know what you're going to get inside. Perfect. Out the freezer and it's set. You can hear that. So what I want to do is start slicing it up. And it's very important to keep it nice and chunky so you get a bit of everything in every mouthful. Just like that. So all you gotta do is just start layering them on your board. Don't forget to keep a few pieces aside that you're actually gonna wrap in that wrapping paper. Just like that. That looks good to me. So before we wrap the other ones, let's give it a dusting of some icing sugar and some cocoa. Oh, that looks decadent. Perfect. So now let's wrap those little ones. You pick out the one that you want, and then very simply, Just like that. And there you go, done. My Baker's Fist of Rocky Road. You have to try this one. Now that you have some inspiration and some delicious inspiration, Bakers is giving one lucky viewer the chance to win a Bakers hamper to the value of 500 Rand. All you have to do is SMS the keyword Bakers to 33650 and you'll automatically be entered into the competition and receive a link to the recipe. SMSs cost 1 Rand 50, no free SMSs apply, T's and C's do apply. Visit afternoonexpress.co.za to find them. Every single one Christmas isn't Christmas without Baker's Choice Assorted. Today's show is definitely feeling festive, so don't go anywhere. We've got exciting competition details to share, and Clem's making chili nut duka topped flatbreads.
welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, Christmas is just around the corner, and what better way to kick things off than by winning yourself this awesome 3G door and door fridge freezer with water and ice dispenser? To enter, visit the Afternoon Express Facebook page and comment on the competition post by letting us know your favorite feature of this beautiful fridge. Not only will you win this magnificent fridge, but we will also stock it with a Clover Christmas hamper. We will be announcing the winner live right here on Afternoon Express this Thursday. So get over to our Facebook page and enter. And something else to come out of your fridge is the delicious little recipes that we make on Afternoon Express. And obviously with Christmas only a week away, the gift getting mad dash is upon us. And who will rescue us from this ensuing madness? Woolies, of course, with their biggest Christmas deals yet. This is your chance to get in on some of the best offers in food and fashion, everything you need to kick off the holiday season in style. And speaking of style, it's time to reveal today's fashion deal and obviously time to be inspired. Pretty fly, you'll look. And it's not one deal, but two. For today and tomorrow only, and for W Rewards members, take 25% off all fashion, that's women's, men's, and kids, and on all swimwear when you pay with your Woolworths card. Just swipe W Rewards and get 20% off. It's literally that simple. Now, Woolies have also gone nuts with today's amazing food deal, because for today and only, at W Rewards card holders will get 20% off their purchases of any two nut tubs and chips and if you pay with your Woolworths store card or your Woolworths credit card you'll receive an additional 5% off. So that's a crazy 25% savings that you'll get and Clem has a delicious recipe using these nuts and he promises that it's going to be one we'll all be trying this festive season. You and Woolies have gone nuts. We really have. So I bought my two tubs this morning and I've been snacking on my first one the whole day. So sure. I was very naughty, but let's get started on this dukkah. So dukkah is basically made up of spices and nuts all ground together. This beautiful, beautiful like sprinkle that goes over breads and meats. But we're gonna keep it a little bit meat free today. Stunning. We're gonna have it over breads. My auntie likes to make it where you kind of like have a typical Italian breads and you dip that in sort of olive oil and you dip that in your in your dukkah and you just eat it like that, like a starter. It's delicious. Exactly, exactly. So but I'm gonna put you to work on the bread though. Sure. So I've rolled one up for you, Salam. Can you add that straight to the hot griddle pan? Sure. While you do that, when you're done, you can roll up some more for me. Cumin seeds going into my little chopper. Cumin seeds are delicious and aromatic. Citrusy flavor coming from our coriander. And I think, like, there's a recipe for this, but you kind of play around with the flavors that you like. Mm -hmm. Chili. Chili is a good one. Like, I would suggest doing the whole tub. And this is one of those things you're going to be hoying <laughs> over the top of or you think, the whole tub. I heard you say the whole tub. I'm thinking that was part of your recipe. No, I think not that's at all. normal. Is that this not normal? Sprinkle. So, we go. Um, so do you use these kind of dukas and stuff on top of these flatbreads? Do you create this one specifically for that, or is this like a dip you can use as well? You can use it as a dip to keep it in the fridge or keep it around. You, and thank you for saying that. You do keep it in the fridge. Okay. Because there are nuts in there which have oils, which will go off. Yeah. Exactly. So what I just did some smoked paprika, some garlic powder, and some mustard seed going in. How are you doing there with your bread? Not very well. I think I'm doing okay though, kind of. Getting there, right? Does yeah, look good? Yeah, you're doing a good job. I don't know how to get it any flatter than that. Can I leave it that size? Yes, you absolutely can. Ready oh. for some noise? Yep. This one's looking so good already, Tim. Yeah. Can I flip him? You can. And oh, once wow, you do that, that so I've got good. some garlic <gasps> infused butter there on the side. Yep. You can start brushing a charred side. Cool, okay. so in go the nuts. Um, we've got some pecans, macadamias, almonds, peanuts, all looking good, and Brazil nuts. My favorite, macadamias. Okay. I don't really, yeah, I don't really have like a favorite. I think almonds are always going to be one of my favorites though. I just know because they, <laughs> they're the lowest in fat. That's that chili that's in there. You <laughs> Is it chili in this oil? Uh, a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> there it we looks go. so good. Okay. Bring it all up. Looking good. What you're going to end up is this. This aroma is already it delicious. Is that, that coriander and that cumin. Mm. There we go. We've got this beautiful sprinkle over here. Mm. I'm going to put this down so I can show you guys how we're going to build this bad boy. So you're going to take. Okay, Dan, Dan what's happening with the, with the bread? He's ready. He's waiting for you, bro. <laughs> cool. Yeah, He's waiting for you. Can I take him off? They cook so quickly as well, don't they? Totally. Can I take him? For um, you? I would say give it like, a, like 30 seconds. Okay, cool. All right, cool. So let's start. I'll take one of these, seeing as you're not done just yet. And I've got some yogurt over here. Let's actually use the one that's not seasoned. 
This is double thick yogurt. You can use any plain yogurt. Just don't go and use strawberry flavored. Yeah. Okay. It's <laughs> and, plain. And don't use those sweetened ones, please. Please do not. Not a good idea. You can use the Greek yogurt, double thick yogurt, pretty much anything that catches your fancy, but it mustn't have a flavor. The idea is to have it be a savory dish. That's exactly the idea. Dan, I, I can smell you need to turn your, your bread. Oh, whoops. Both again? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So on the oil side, I must go back down. Uh -huh. Now it's gonna get nice and crispy. Oh, I so see. you can give it another buttering. Cool. This is actually quite a lot of fun. I enjoy making dukkha and stuff like that, especially making flatbreads. It's a great way to serve guests food. And that your main course can be like a light, delicate meal because this is like a meal on its own. Yeah, you can do it outside and chill. Mm. It's summer. We cool. don't have a white Christmas here, so I mean, take your guests outside. Totes. Definitely. What do you so, call it when you have like your, your, your guests outside and you have like a dinner outside? Al fresco. Al fresco. So like fresco in Italian just means cool. So it's like, I guess, a cooled dinner. Or just, I don't know. Al fresco. Maybe means, it just like, means chill. Cool. <laughs> Dad, this guy. Know. All right, cool. There we go. Some mint, some coriander goes on. That looks so and good. And you're winning. Tim. Amazing. Just like that. You can also probably yeah. keep this separate to the dishes, like he's done over there, and just stick your, your delicious flatbreads into the dip itself and. Voila, you got the perfect starter for your friends and family at home. Now, if you'd like the link to this recipe, send straight to your phone along with the ingredient list. You SMS the keyword Woolworths to 33650 at a cost of 1 Rand 50. Remember, the free SMSs don't apply. Now, that's savings done right. And make sure that you head to your nearest Woolies today and tomorrow to cash in on fashion deals for the entire family, including some of your Afternoon Express presenter wardrobe favorites. You only have two days to do this, guys. That's all that's left. And you can shop both the fashion and food deals in store or online at www.woolworths.co.za and through the Woolworths app as well. Products available at selected stores while stocks last. T's and C's apply. How would you like to win an amazing prize worth 3,000 Rand? Well, after the break, it's time for our 2017 Clicks Advent Calendar. So keep your phone handy and our number on speed dial. It's 021-430-9881. Remember that the lines will only open when we say the command. So you stay tuned. We'll be right back. The Clicks Advent Calendar on Afternoon Express has 36,000 rands worth of prizes to be won to make your Christmas wishes come true. Among the prizes we've given away, there's been a sorbet product hamper and a collection of Jen's fine fragrances. But the joy continues with a Claire's accessories hamper and a car rental gift from Europe Car still up for grabs. Don't miss your chance to win with the hashtag Clicks Christmas and Afternoon Express at 4 p.m. on SABC3.
the Clicks Advent Calendar on Afternoon Express has 36,000 rands worth of prizes to be won to make your Christmas wishes come true. There's been a net florist hamper and a delicious hamper of fine chocolates and confectionery. But the joy continues with a collection of Jen's fine fragrances and a sorbet product hamper up for grabs. So do you have your phone ready? Welcome to the Clicks Advent Calendar on Afternoon Express. Let me quickly just tell the people in charge of the phones that the lines must open in three, two, one, go! The lines are open 021-430-9881. Don't forget, obviously, a 3,000 Rand prize up for grabs if you choose a number today. The first person through to the floor will get to choose the number and win themselves that prize. Now, last week, Shirley won the Claire's Accessories Hamper to the value of 3,000 Rand, but there are still three boxes left to choose from. You could be today's winner. The lines are now open, so call in and let's see if today is your lucky day. I've only got three numbers left. I've got number two, four, and five. Right, let's try and see if we can cross to Cape Town. CB, welcome to Afternoon Express. Thank you very much. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And you? I'm doing so well. This is one of my favorite parts of the show today, because they're going to give you some free prizes. So you're already through. You already uh, are a winner. Thank you. Do you have a lucky number between number two, four, and number five? Number five, please. Number five is right behind me over here. So you've gone with a small box. Is that for a reason? Um, I feel lucky, looking okay. at that number. She's feeling lucky. Small box, Lovely. big dynamite comes in small packages. Let's see Thank you very much. what's inside here. There seems to be an envelope inside of this package. Oh, what is you. inside the envelope? I can tell you, you've won yourself a Europe Car Voucher. Congratulations! Wow. Thank you, thank you very much. To the value of 3,000 Rand, are you excited? I am so excited. Thank you so, so much. It's an absolute pleasure. I hope this contributes towards your travels. Are you going to be spending time with family and friends? Oh, she's gone. I hope she does get to spend some time with family and friends. That this free ride for her, the value of 3,000 Rand, only creates memories, courtesy of the Clicks Advent Calendar and Afternoon Express. Now, don't forget about the Clicks Advent Calendar Grand Prize, which is different to the prize you're running today. It's 50,000 Rand's worth of products, including a Remington product hamper, Philips Oral Hygiene body hamper and so much more just head over to the afternoon express facebook page and reply to the original competition post listing the three items from clicks that are on your particular wish list and don't forget to use the hashtag clicks christmas vas rates apply t's and c's apply visit afternoonexpress.co.za to find them and remember that the competition will close on wednesday the 20th of december Tis the season to be winning with the Clicks Advent Calendar Competition on Afternoon Express. Call in, pick a box, and you could win hampers of fragrances, body care products, cosmetics, and sweet treats, and so much more from hashtag Clicks Christmas. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, what's going on? I'm refreshing what are you the doing? screen. What are you doing? Don't touch this. I'm still one. Do not touch the screen. <laughs> okay, so from a competition of like a public nature to one more intimate, uh, we have two dishes presented here. Um, yeah. And we asked you to please get involved because we think that you are the better judges because some of us are biased in the loft and the question we asked you is who is going to win the At Clover Way Better Trifle Challenge? Hashtag Afternoon Express. And thank you so much for partaking and sending us all your answers so and your much. opinions. You know what? Some of you had some really funny things to say. Like your first answer was Sura Ramaphosa. Ha, funny. Ha, 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 ha. Get it. Ha, ha, ha. We get it funny. Um, but this is very close to my heart because I love trifles. Like mm. if, if you're black and you grew up in Soweto, you know what trifles mean to a person. Yeah. So I'd like to say that well, my, money, in that my case, bias has already swung. Towards jeans. But can I just say something? Like, what, you, what I want to show you here is take a look at what's on our, on our, on our, on our tablet at the moment. Can you I know you can tell if you voted for something, there's a little tick that pops next to the name. So what I'm going to say is that the team, our social media team from Afternoon Express, they've uh, obviously selected that Genie is going to be our winner today. How crazy. Are you saying it's rigged? Yeah, I'm telling you it's rigged. I'm going to try and see if I can, yeah, it's, uh, yeah I can see that. So you know, look like... There. Look there, there's a little tick okay, there. You've just implied that... No, it's not mean rigged. She's very no, 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 that means that Afternoon Express voted for her, and they were like, 
55 votes, and so that means one that more would have made us tie. What's going on now? What's Jeez. going on? Is, is that what it means? I tell you, I've yet to meet a worse loser in my life. Wow. I'm terrible Danilo, at losing. you don't I, take losing very well. I don't well. lose very well. I really hope that your New Year's resolution is to lose better. Please pass me. So doesn't that just are essentially like mean that in case the presenters are having a dumb moment and they can't figure out who won, that it becomes very quickly clear that it was Jeannie who won? A tick next to her name. Yeah, because she got no. 53%. That's because I've got more votes. And you got 47%. So in case we run out of what? time. You know what? So all of you have been part of the show for the last the year and a half. I'm life. coming for you. You know that, right? For all of you who voted for Jeannie D on Twitter. Right. Love you all so much. Everybody loves you. Everybody loves you. I'm a sore Jeannie. loser, guys. I'm a terrible wow. loser. We've learned this it's about myself. so unattractive. This looks so good. Oh, that is so <laughs> hilarious. Cool. Anyway, so today's show was so upset. amazing. I have to tell you that it's so funny that... Like right at the end of the year, we got to interview somebody who I've really been wanting to interview for years. Capano is somebody who I remember reading her book so many years ago, and I'm so happy that we had her in the loft today. She's phenomenal. Aww. She is really cool. She is yeah. really amazing. And yeah, apparently, I can actually show you guys uh, the stuff on our Twitter page. Oh, at the moment. you are joking! No, no, no. I just wanted to show you that little tick. I know you guys have seen it at home, but just uh, take a look at that little you tick. You are so that's competitive. You are such a, a sore loser. There. I love it. And I love that? you. You see that? I find it incredibly mm -hmm. unattractive. Try again next year. <laughs> <laughs> just, dip, just dip your flatbreads. All right. Give him another chance. Well, well done, Ginny. Actually, I, I tasted a bit of your trifle in that glass, and it was really delicious. Thank well you done. so much. Yeah. Mm. Well, I've served up one of these, which is absolutely amazing. Clems is obviously going to win. I also like. <laughs> mm. Cute. Have you done all your Christmas shopping yet? I have indeed done most of it. I'm heading off okay. um, towards the end of this week. So yeah. I've done all the ones that needed to be in South Africa. I've left them in South Africa and they're all done and dusted. Okay. So I bought all the Woolies things that we had on the show for everybody that I know. And then on Expresso, they've got those massive Lilos. I've literally bought everybody a Lilo. Oh, really? Lilos are amazing. No, they're great. When are Bonnie and Mines arriving? You don't have a swimming pool, neither does Bonnie. And we've already gifted each other, remember? Oh, that's so. true. Yeah, you guys and also, we kind of live in an area where we have to be water conscious. Exactly. Fact, the whole world has to be water conscious. I actually think that yeah, it's... Yeah, we're not it's filling a, up pools at the moment. It's a consciousness the whole world needs to move Absolutely. towards. Yeah. I think what we should do, I don't know how you guys feel about this at home, but perhaps on our Friday episode of Afternoon Express, yeah. I think it's our last episode of the year, 22nd of December, we should like reminisce on our favorite moments on the show. We should take a moment to think back to some of our favorite That's interviews. That's a great idea. So that is a great idea. I think it'll be really cool because we've had a really long time. Did you come up with that all on your own? All yes, on his own. Totally. <laughs> I know, hey? All on your lonesome. Genius this over here. Genius should we over do here. Do it this Friday. All on this your Friday. ace. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Okay, so hashtag Afternoon Express. Go to our Twitter pages. This time, it doesn't matter who you vote for because it's all about your favorite guests on the show. What have been some of your favorite moments and guests we've had on Afternoon You're Express? You're more than welcome to, uh, to chat about who your favorite presenters are as well. <laughs> Absolutely. Please just throw it in there. Put it in there. What is your favorite recipes? Whatever, whatever <laughs> fans, whatever you fancy. Use the hashtag Afternoon Express and we'll try and relive some of those moments on Friday for our final edition of Afternoon Express for the year. Okay. I just want to add that thank you to everyone who knows me, my friends, my family, everybody, Shameless that you don't punt. require for me to buy you anything for Christmas because I'm <laughs> such a beautiful gift in your lives that you feel so overwhelmed and grateful. Mm. Do you have any news resolutions? I do. I do. What are um, they? <laughs> What was it again? I'm going to learn how to dance to gom. To gom. <laughs> gom dance. We'll see that on Friday as well. That. How about that? Mm -hmm. yeah, Somebody show us on Friday. I want to be like... Dun, dun, dun. Like, I just... Okay. Please, let's, I just let's have take never a... been able to dance. Next week... I mean, next year, Bonnie and I are going to do a dance lesson a week. Okay, deal. Yeah. No. I mean, ranging from ballet to gom. We're going to yeah. do it all. <laughs> I love it. All right, let's wrap up the show today, everybody. Enough from us on Afternoon Express. Thank you so much for tuning into the show and for being part of our family. We absolutely love hanging out in your homes every single weekday. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Have a brilliant evening and obviously have a happy eating with all of your trifle that you've made for yourselves. And if you did make your own, go and send us a tweet of it. Hashtag Afternoon Express. We love you. Good night Bye. and happy eating. Love you. I'm not bored. Afternoon Express, made with love by Clover. Another feel-good production.